Welcome to the PGA Long Drive Competition. Long Drive Competition is back here at the PGA Championship for the first time since 1985. It's an historic event. Jack Nicklaus won it twice, the first time back in 1963. It was a 341-yard drive with a persimmon driver. Not too shabby. He also went on to win the PGA Championship. Let's see who can take it home today. Adam Scott kicked it off early on Tuesday morning with a 320 yard drive. Very quickly though, Keegan Bradley went and teed it up, bombing it 326. He held the lead for about 45 seconds until Ricky Fowler, who he was playing with, took him two yards longer at 328. Ricky Fowler, 328. All right, Keegan, well, it was very short lived, but for a point you held the top spot on the long drive competition leaderboard. How fun was it for those few moments? It was really fun. <laughs> uh, I think they should do this every week. It's a great, it's a great tournament. It's a great idea. It's some nice money to um, uh, to raise it for charities. I used to hit along just in the you know 80s and 90s, and, and that just shows you if Jack had the technology that we have today when he was young, he'd probably out hit us all. Talk about uh, how talented you are at the Happy Gilmore shot. <laughs> uh, not as talented as I think I am. Jason Day, 338. The players saved the best for last. Late in the day, a pair of South Africans playing together, PGA Club professional Johan Koch and Louis Oosthuizen took bronze and gold home, respectively. Being a club professional, this is such a great addition to the week because it is something I am not planning on winning this golf tournament. If I can make the cut, it would be amazing. But this was something I knew if I can catch a good drive, I could you know, may maybe make the top three and take, take something home with me. It's just good fun. And we got there, and the people were there, and you could see they really wanted us to, to bomb a few. And um, yeah, the two of us uh, got all of two.